Children's lives are being saved every day right here in the Ohio Valley by a special team on the ground and in the air. The WVU Medicine Children's Transport Team brings even the smallest and sickest patients to the best care possible. In just a few weeks, the area will come together to support the people who save these kids. And if you need to know why your support is so critical, just ask one of the team's most recent patients. I'll definitely be back to dancing soon. Olivia Kiger Camilo lights up the stage with her dancing. And thanks to the doctors at WVU Medicine Children's, the 17-year-old will perform again. In fact, it was after a weekend of dancing that Olivia first noticed a pain in her foot, an early sign of what would become a life-threatening experience. You know, as a dancer, as an athlete, you kind of just brush it aside. I thought maybe I broke a toe. Her condition worsened, and Olivia's parents took her to the emergency room. Eventually, she was airlifted by the WVU Medicine Children's Transport Team to Morgantown. I had to have emergency surgery. They um, could kind of tell what it was. They had to do biopsies and test it first, but um, by that point they knew they had to take really aggressive action. Olivia had an extremely rare case of a flesh-eating bacteria in her foot. She first arrived at the hospital in March, spent time in the ICU, and was on a ventilator. Through the weeks of her stay, Olivia had multiple surgeries. You know, I had like a new family there to take care of me and I never felt scared. I always knew that there was going to be someone there to help me, whether it was to make me laugh or to hold my hand or to give me medicine. Her last surgery was at the end of April and now Olivia is doing physical therapy and getting stronger every day. She credits her life to the staff and their compassionate care. And now Olivia says she wants to be a doctor so she can impact someone's life with the same personal and heartfelt care. So they would just take hours out of their very busy schedule to just sit with me and answer all of my crazy questions about what was happening to me and all of the other um, cases that they've treated. And it all started with the WVU Medicine Children's Transport Team. Transport team saved my life, um, and it saves lives every day. Um, children who wouldn't be able to get um, competent medical care wherever they live, um, they have a chance at life. Olivia has been cleared by her doctors, so she's doing physical therapy to work on strength and mobility. She's also running and lifting weights because she hopes to go to the Naval Academy after finishing her senior year at Lindsley. Now, if you'd like to support the WVU Medicine Children's Transport Team, you can do so at the upcoming gala. It's on Saturday, August 6th at Ogilvy. Last year alone, the transport team cared for 689 children and mothers. 117 of them were from the Ohio Valley. If you'd like to attend a gala,